Sabre is a baller. I mean, day in, day out, every practice, he just comes to who comes to compete. He's the best, he's the best teammate you can have, so I really appreciate him. Oh, I was just going to say, Preston State Inter has not lost hot defense in terms of points allowed per game. You know, what was working for you tonight, and, and how did you able to shoot uh, so well from the field? Uh, we just watched a lot of film. We knew it was going to be an inside-out game, and uh, our base just uh, found us tonight. And we just knocked down shots. We were hot from three, I'm pretty sure. Um, and, yeah. Marcus, just piggybacking off of Rachel's question, you know, you had parts where you just kind of were seemingly put in this basket. You know, what? How, how good were you feeling out there tonight? Uh, I was feeling great. Uh, the fans definitely helped. Uh, as soon as one goes in, just the basket gets bigger. I'm pretty sure that it goes for every player. Uh, yeah, just good team win tonight. And then just the, you know, you guys have been strong defensively the last, especially the last month, you know, seven straight games, you guys have allowed 60 or fewer points. But, you know, tonight, late game defense really won it for you guys. You know, what do you guys have to do to kind of, you know, stick it in there and, you know, when the going gets tough, you guys just keep staying tough. Uh, we just had to thug it out, really. Um, we we're switching one through five and that, that worked for us. Uh, yeah, just everybody just took off their gloves and just locked up on defense. We take pride in our defense and uh, it paid off tonight. E-Man, you guys were tied at 50. What allowed you guys to finish down the stretch? We've been in a lot of these tough games throughout the year. I think we're getting comfortable in playing these kind of gritty games. and. We just kept our composure, having an experienced group. You know, we're just ready to go out there and play. So I think that's what attributed to our winning line. Did it feel different that this is the conference opener? I mean, as Coach Rice and the staff stressed that, like these games are worth almost twice as much? No, I think we took every game this year um, with the, you know, having the will to win and coming out and competing. And we're just taking it one game at a time, and whether it's conference, non-conference, playoffs, it doesn't matter. We're going to come out and compete the best of, to the best of our ability. Obviously, everybody's going to remember those two big shots for you. You had the jumper and then the free pointer to put you guys up 55 to 50. But kind of a freshman behind the scenes there with the two steals. Um, you know, what did you think of his performance and, you know, standing up defensively tonight? Oh, he did great tonight. Um, <laughs> defensively, he stepped it up big time for us, and we needed that. And, uh, yeah, just Deggy. Man, what did you guys think about that? You know, thank you. he's a freshman, true freshman, but he does not he's play not like a freshman, freshman at all. He takes it very seriously, watching the film, understanding the scout. You know, he's not the quickest or, you know, fastest out there, but he's definitely one of the smartest dudes out there. So I gotta give my credit to T. Dagan for playing spectacular for him. You know, if you would have told me that Dagan Hart's gonna take three shots all game and make two of them, I would have said, uh oh, I mean, I would have thought maybe you guys would have been able to win by 20. What do you think it says about the team and then him too? Just letting the game come to him, not freaking out because he's not getting his shots up. I think um, like everybody on this team has the ability to score. And um, I don't know, he just lets the game, like you said, he lets the game come to him. He wasn't forcing anything. And uh, everybody else was hitting shots and uh, he just stuck with it. Marcus, you reflect on this current seven game win streak. Where do you feel like you guys have improved the most? Late game situations, um, defensively and offensive execution as well.